What's up, YouTube? I'm here with another video. Just to purchase my first dirt bike. How's it going? I'm a YouTuber. I, yeah, uh, well, this is my uh, mechanic. How long have you owned it? Maybe six years. Okay. But I got it, uh, had it just the uh, piston and jug had just been redone. Okay. When you got it? Yeah. Okay. And I probably have 20 hours on it. Right on. What kind of ride you do? Single track up there. Yeah. Uh, like so. Everett and Mayo. Okay. Up by Grayling and Gaylord. Yep, that's uh, Otsego County. That's, that's where I like to go as well. You see my trail pig up there. I'm trying to get. That's what he's trying <laughs> to get into. So. Is down. It's got on. the bigger. It's got the bigger um, fuel tank on it, yeah, so I it's a pain that. to change plugs. Oh uh, yeah. Yeah, that's a big old tank, huh? It's just over three gallons. Right on. Smokes. Yeah, the uh, yeah that's down and on. on. All right, sweet. Yeah, pointing out this way is reserve. Pointing in is off. You ever need the choke to start it? Probably. It might start. I mean, it's pretty warm out right now. Okay. It might start without it. Right on. Right on. I know I had to choke it yesterday when I made that video because that was the first time it's run since this time last year. Yeah. We always go out, we wait until September to go up north. Okay. It's just too hot to try to do that in June. Right. June, July. Usually we're camping with family up there then. The gasket here or something of that nature. Not just the normal spooge between the... Right, yeah. Where the uh, header pipe meets the tailpipe. Because like I run it a little rich just right. to not melt pistons. Right, yeah, better, better a little rich than me. Yes. Under the straps so you can kick through. Oh, yeah. I'm, oh, I'm used to electric start. And you got boots on? Yeah, well, these boots, I kicked a hole in the bottom of them, so it's kind of hard to get down, but... Kickstand's not there. He got a spare for that. Yeah. Right a little easier with the boots on, eh? Yeah, I've messed up my feet too many times. A lot of compression, don't it? Yeah, like my old CR250, I could, I could start that in flip flops. Yeah, not this one. Yeah. My 450, even with decompression, isn't yeah. too bad. Yeah, I can. Yeah, I, I can start my 450 in flip flops, even honestly. Yeah. I'm gonna have problems, boy. Definitely need some boots. I, yeah, it'll be. I stole my kids' boots. <laughs>
That's the choke under there. Oh, it must be in gear. Yeah, it is. I'll probably spin on the tire. Yeah, the choke is right. Might even just have to undo it to get it in gear. But it can be very embarrassing sometimes. <laughs> I left the fuel on when I took it up north okay. two seasons ago. Yeah. And we screwed around with it at the trailhead for ever. That's always the best. That's gonna be a doozy for me. You never kickstarted anything before, huh? Not, not with no compression like this. Yeah, all these old 300s, these old KTMs, the 300s, the 380s. Once it starts, runs for yeah. at least that long, then it's put it on top. So that is a pretty common spot to leak it in 